Closer to home, people in our area made different arrangements for Easter as well, from outdoor services that encourage social distancing to the virtual kind. Crystal Cranmore reports on how religious leaders and congregants had to amend tradition. Coverings could not stop the praises that rang throughout Philadelphia's Love Park Easter Sunday. Hallelujah! It was a celebration of the resurrection of Jesus Christ as several people lined up to be baptized by bottled water, starting a new life as members of Chosen 300 Ministries. The organization primarily serves those in need. No matter what's going on in the world today, Jesus is alive! As organizers encourage social distancing amid fears of spreading COVID-19, this outdoor service was a way to offer spiritual support to worshipers. Oh God, who on this day through your only begotten Son. Meanwhile, at the Cathedral Basilica of Saints Peter and Paul, hymns filled a near empty church as leaders called on parishioners to stay home during the pandemic. Parishes and churches uh, all over are uh, making use of social media and technology to continue to bring people together in prayer. The Greater Exodus Baptist Church in North Philadelphia also streamed service online after Pastor Herb Lusk canceled in-person services early Sunday morning after speaking with city leaders. In an email to Eyewitness News, Lusk said in part, this decision pains me a great deal that on the most important day in the history of Christianity, the doors of this sanctuary will not be open to the people. Church leaders express while it might be a different Holy Week, it's still holy nonetheless. What makes it holy is the powerful story that gets we told and we live as we as we once again uh, reflect on on the death and the and the rising of Christ. Crystal Cranmore, CBS3 Eyewitness News.